Lenovo has announced the K800 mobile phone. It's the first phone in the world with an Intel processor. So finally ARM will have some competition in the mobile processor business. This K800 phone from Lenovo that runs on the Intel Atom CPU is only the beginning I think. Uh, we will see a lot of phones with this CPU from now on. Uh, Motorola has also announced that they are going to follow Lenovo's example by releasing at least one phone with the Atom technology. So I think uh, this is only the beginning. And also it will be interest interesting to see if these phones with Intel Atom CPUs has better battery life than phones with ARM CPUs. That will be very interesting. This is how the Lenovo K800 looks like. Quite big phone. It has a 4.5 inch HD 720p TFT screen. And it also has a 1.6 GHz Intel Atom uh, CPU, from, also called Medfield. 8 megapixel camera. And as you can see, it runs on a highly modified Android 2.3. Uh, too bad it, it's not a modified uh, Android 4.0 though. The phone also has a Bluetooth 3.0 and a GPS in built in, GPS navigator. Here you can see how the back side looks like. Here you can see more from the highly modified Android 2.3. The K800 from Lenovo also has a new technology from Intel called VIDI. Uh, that technology allows you to connect the device to external monitors through a wireless connection. Uh, it's, it sounds like uh, Apple's AirPlay or something. Could be useful. As you can see the Lenovo K800 is quite big phone. Very edgy too. Squared phone kind of futuristic look I believe it's the phone in the middle by the way I think, I think it looks very interesting really Lenovo phones will probably never come to Europe though but uh, Intel's new chips will probably be in phones for Europe in the future. That was the phone from Lenovo K K800 uh, running on a new ship from Intel. Uh, what do you think of this phone though? Uh, please tell me in the comments what you think of this. Uh, and also what you think of the future for um, Intel's new Atom chips for mobile phones. Please tell me in the comments. I really appreciate if you comment about that. Okay, that's it for today.